guys, Friend with Craft Scissors here with another plan with me. So we are in my happy planner, so make sure you check out the link below for the Plan With Me Design Group Collab um, blog link so you can check out the other channels as well. Um, we also have a Facebook group if you want to make sure you don't miss out on any of our posts. Some of us post in there when we have new videos or if we're running late or anything like that. So this is the week of my birthday, so I picked this kit from Sticker Monster Co. Um, like I said before, I'm pretty sure I ordered this actually for Zingo to Mayo. Um, but I got here a little bit later than I planned, so I didn't end up doing this and go to my spread, I don't think. Um, but I thought it's a party, it says party like there's no tomorrow, so I thought, you know, that'll work for my birthday, so I kept it back for that, and so I made a taco clip. Um, the kit actually doesn't have a taco in it, but I like it, it's Mexican food, so there you go. And then I have a red glitter bow over here to go with the red that's in it. I did think about doing a little red pepper, but, um, I just didn't have time, so... <laughs> We ended up with a taco and a red bow. So, alright, so the the kit itself is um, a different format than normal. So there's a couple things um, that I'm going to do differently. So in s basically there's six checklist boxes and I need um, seven. So I'm going to be using this one for one of the row, for one of them. I know it's not going to match these at all. Um, I'm going to use this one. And then for the sidebar checklist, I'm going to stack a top three and this top three and then cover up that header of top three. And I think that'll work out just fine as far as I think so. I mean, there's checklists there, but they're, they're like half box checklists. Like if I wanted to put checklists in here. So um, that's what that's for. So let's go ahead and do our date covers. Um, it doesn't come with the date dots. So... Um, I pulled some. I wasn't sure. I think I'm gonna go with these ones. I was thinking about going with these ones, but I'm thinking the dark brown on this one is too dark. So I'm gonna skip that one and do this one. So I know the first is Sunday. I'm gonna put that one there. And then Tuesday is the 26th. I'll put that there. And then so Monday would be the 25th, and that would be the 27th, and then 28th. So I don't know if you guys want me to talk about my birthday, <laughs> um, but like I said, my husband's kind of not telling me what we're doing, so I don't have anything to share with you guys on like what my plan is for the day. But you guys have already said lots of happy birthdays, so thank you so much for that. Okay, so I think I'm going to go ahead and start with my date covers, and then I'll do my headers. Um, I think that's how I'll do it. And then the washi tape, if you guys want to see that ahead of time. I pulled this one. It was in the sampler, um, that unicorn book that uh, Pretty Planner Robin gave to me. So there's this one, and it says talk about cute, and has like nachos and peppers and tacos. And this one has little avocados that are like foiled. So I thought I might use those. I don't know. They're more like stickers than they are washi. So that's pretty different. I don't know. And then I got this one. I'm not sure who this is from. But I think these are from Planner Attic Boxes. Um, but I thought the cactus is cute. And then I also pulled in the cactus from the Planner Society and Hobby Lobby. And then this is from that like Fiesta roll that I had. None of these match. None of these ones match because it's very, it's very, it's very, it's very much um, the orange, the red, the green, the yellow. And these don't really have those colors. Um, so I pulled those out and then grabbed ones that I thought would still work. Pulled out the gold just in case as like a spacer kind of thing. So uh, we'll see what I end up using. All right, let's get started. Like I said. Okay, so Monday the 25th. So this kit is made for the Happy Planner. So everything is going to fit it as is, which is really nice. Because normally I don't use Happy Planner kits. I use Erin Condren kits and I have to do a lot of washi tape and such. So I did get my Planner Society box um, for for June. Yeah. <laughs> like, wait, what month am I? <laughs> um, so I did get that and I'm excited about using it. Um, I think I already know what my project's going to be. It's going to be pretty simple. Um, it's going to be more planner related. Um, cause sometimes I do more craft related is what I was trying to say. 
So sometimes those videos are little craft projects that you can use just anything. Um, which honestly, so was my my box from last month. I did what I do. I did the envelope to go in my planner. So I don't know if some of you did that one with me or not, but I got a lot of positive feedback that you guys thought it was cute, pretty handy. Then 29th. So for this one, it is going to be very much planner related again. I haven't really like, basically I wander around <laughs> um, my Michaels and try to get inspired if I do a craft project or I see something online that I am like, I can use the Planner Society box to do that. That's usually how those come to be. <laughs> so, or like in December I did the Christmas ornament. Like that was kind of like on theme, I guess, if that makes any sense. Okay. So my birthday is on a Saturday and I did tell you guys in the last video, hopefully you guys caught that part. Um, my new releases are going to stay the same and be on Thursday, but I am having a sale on my birthday. I'm not giving much detail about it. Um, cause it's going to be a flash sale. It'll only be on Saturday and there will be a freebie. Um, I guess I can show you that I have some made. They're all a little different, um, because it's pattern paper, but it's a party bow. So it's like confetti and such, like little dots and flakes and little asterisks. So what varies is like the colors that you'll end up with on yours, if that makes sense. So like that one has like pinks and that one has blue. That one has like a purple one. So it all is like varied. Um, I think I'm going to do them all on gold clips. So they're all different, if that makes sense. So there's those. But I'm working on making those for you guys for the sale. Just for fun. Okay, so my top is my to-do. I'm gonna use this. It looks like a little cactus. Like there's little lines on it. Make it look like kind of like a cactus. That's cool. Let's pull this over. All right, I'm putting green headers on a green box. This is gonna go great. <laughs> oh man, okay. Cause I can't really tell if it's crooked. Does that make sense? Cause the green. <laughs> On green but oh well it'll be fun so my to do's is like errands to run and stuff like that like it mostly is filled up with like me running to the store or me going to the post office or any kind of doctor's appointments or bill paying all of that kind of goes in the top box and then the middle one is like my cleaning things to do around the house that kind of thing like sometimes I put my son's bath in the top box and then sometimes I put it in the middle box. <laughs> Depends on where I have room, <laughs> if that makes sense. Okay, I still need to research salon, um, nail salons. I don't need to get them done anytime soon, but I'd like to get my research done and make my first appointment um, because I know that some of the nail salons in my town get filled up fairly quickly. Like the one I go to, most of the time you can't call the day before and get an appointment. Most of the time you can't do a walk-in. Like it's a pretty busy place because they do a really good job. But the problem is they've just messed up so much in the past few months. Like they've misplaced my appointment. So then I had to wait extra long. Um, then they... Um, they were late to starting my appointment this last time. So I was just like, I'm done. Okay, so I can use this as glitter headers. And then this is a glitter header. So those ones are gonna be glitter headed. But I'm gonna go ahead and do my full boxes and then do the next header. Okay, so this is gonna be my theme sticker that has the quote on it. Fiesta like there's no mañana. Okay, a little bit of Spanglish there. All right, I don't really like that movie. Have you seen it? It's not a good movie. I remember because my Spanish teacher in high school had the poster in his room, and I was like, you know that's not a very good movie, right? And he was like, what are you talking about? And I like told him the storyline, and he was like super embarrassed, like ripped down the poster. <laughs> I know. <laughs> like, I just tell people. <laughs> I just tell people how it is, and that's what happens. <laughs> so, um... I've already mentioned that I've been to Mexico several times. Well, I've mentioned it several times. I've only been four times. Um, 
Loved it every time. Never had a bad experience. I didn't go resorting. It was, um, I didn't go to like any place fancy or like Tijuana or wherever people go now. Um, I was in a little town called Quintana Roo, Quintana Roo, something like that. And I think there's two of them in Mexico. Mine was the one that's closer to the border, <laughs> if that makes sense. So, but yeah, there was a church there and we helped out there. It wasn't like a missions trip, like we were going to like convert people. <laughs> that's not what it was at all. <laughs> um, we were honestly just there to like help with their ministry and like any projects they had. So like one year, I think I said I did VBS and then another year it was like, um, I helped put insulation in for a pharmacy and one year we dug a septic tank. Like it was just different every year. So, which was kind of the fun of it. The first year I went, we did stay in a hotel, but it wasn't like a fancy hotel. There was, um, chickens and then there was a giant bug in the bathroom. Um, <laughs> that's what I remember. So I feel like that's the same, just a different background. Oh, maybe it's not. I feel like I should move it over. I think I will. I think this is going to go over here. Anyhow. Yeah, I think so. But I enjoyed my time there. And what our favorite thing to do was to go to the hot dog stand. They served hot dogs wrapped in bacon. That's all I'm going to say. I'm just going to throw that out there. Hot dogs wrapped in bacon. So that was pretty delicious. And so was the burgers. And I collected like the glass bottles because that wasn't like we have them now in the United States. Like you can buy glass bottled sodas again at the grocery store. But it used to not be that way. <laughs> so I was collecting them from my kitchen because I have a Coca-Cola kitchen. Oh, and someone asked for an office walkthrough. Yeah, that's never going to happen. Um, one, it's not that you can't walk around my office. It's just like a hot mess because my office is in the living room. So that's why I would not, I'm not going to do that. But thanks for asking. Um, but I just, I, I don't know. I share the living room as a living room as my husband's office because he does shop stuff too a little bit um, with like pulling orders and packaging and stuff so there's that it's just kind of a hot mess um i took a picture once of my lighting for um for teresa but other than that i haven't really like shown anyone my living room set up and honestly when people come over they just like stare at it like i'm a weirdo i'm like yeah well the office in the, the spare bedroom is just not big enough. <laughs> it's honestly not. Because we considered putting me in there by myself. But then it's like there's things that I need to like talk to my husband about. Or like I still want to be involved in like what my son is doing. Because like he can play next to me and like color next to me. And we can still talk while I'm working on stuff. So. Or it's like he can sit in the living room and watch a movie and it's like we're kind of watching it together when I'm working. I don't know how to explain that one, but it was funny because tonight we did family movie night. We watched The Rescuers Down Under, the one with the boy, if you're like, which one's that? And <laughs> after I was done eating my pizza, I was like, so can mom go back to work now? And he's like, no, mom, stay on the couch. He's like, but don't fall asleep because I always fall asleep in his kid movies if I sit on the couch. Like, honestly, like you put me on a comfy spot in the dark and I get kind of warm I'm gonna fall asleep that's just what's gonna happen this seems kind of like an orangey red like a burnt red it's not like a bright glitter red if that makes any sense at all oh my gosh oh my gosh what did I no okay I just had like a deja vu movement moment. I don't know. I thought I did something wrong in my spread and then I didn't. I think I plan in a lot of planners is what that is. Oh, well. <laughs> Nothing's wrong with my spread. I just had this like weird moment. Okay. So my checklist that's going to be weird is this one along with 
these. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, the other six. So that makes seven, but it won't match the other ones. So, but either way it wouldn't match. So that's kind of how I had to do this. All right, so I'm thinking this one is gonna end up over here. I don't think it's any longer. I think it's the same length as a full box checklist. I think it's the same. Yeah, it's the same. I'm gonna put these down. And then, like I said, I'm gonna like, combine those for like my mini grocery list that I put on the side. I'm gonna do it that way. So, anyway, so we did a pizza and movie night, and he said I couldn't go back to work. But I did get three new releases done today. Um, two are kind of limited, there's only eight of them. Um, but one you guys have been asking for for a while, so. And then, yes, Jennifer, one of them is from your list because it's that week is coming up. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> oh, my hints are horrible. That's all there is to it. <laughs> okay, so this is my, like, to clean stuff around the house. Empty the refrigerator, change the sheets, you know, that kind of stuff. Clean the litter box which that's what I, you guys usually see. Because, like, the other stuff isn't really scheduled out. I just like to mark it when I do it so I know when I last did it. That makes sense. We actually are working on cleaning out our kitchen right now. Um, throughout the summer, we like to do little projects in each room, like to take on or clean out or go through our closets. That's what we did a couple weeks ago. I think I mentioned that. I was, like, we went through our closets and got rid of a bunch of old stuff and took it to the Salvation Army. Um, so we did that. My he my son actually went through his books too, which is great because now they all fit on his bookshelf. Because there was just some that like were too babyish or he was tired of reading or they were really ripped up and they just needed to be gone, which is sad. But, you know, he was a baby. Um, oh, I didn't use that full box. I might use it over here somewhere. You never know. All right, next set of headers is the green ones. Let me put these ones up there I used to put my headers down first sometimes but then sometimes the boxes if they were a little too long covered them up and so I've decided to not do that I've decided to put down the date covers first and then have my header like butt up against that and then put my full boxes down and then the next headers but I'm going row by row instead of putting all the headers down but I used to do it that way you just I mean you can change up how you plan whenever which honestly, I think that's the fun part of like not saying like you can once you find your planner piece or whatever that people talk about, um, then yeah, you can stick in the you can stay in the same planner. But honestly, they make changes in the planners like every year. So you might love it this year and then not like it next year. Or maybe your life might change a little. Like if you add school or a different job or a kid, you know, then you might need a different kind of planner. So as life changes, you might need a different one. Just like if you decide you want to do more fitness stuff, then it's like, like I've changed this planner. The middle box used to be fitness and um, daily meal tracking. Yeah, it was. If you're like fairly new to my channel, I didn't know it. I definitely had it set up that way before. Okay, so I'm going to take out these flowers with the washi that's in this kit. Most definitely. And I'm probably going to continue and use that on this side. I think I see. Yeah, okay. Just making sure. I hit the camera a little bit. So I'm not going to care that this overhangs a little. Ooh, whoa. I'm not going to be cutting this down to fit because it's for the happy planner, so I shouldn't need to. Does that make sense? I'm going to get it all the way to the bottom without it hanging over or bubbling up. That is the goals. Okay, and then there's these washi, those are washi strips, not full boxes. If you're like, what are those? <laughs> those buddy. That's a meme. <laughs> in case you didn't know. Just in case. Okay. Oh, stickers. That wasn't like a gosh darn it. There was a sticker like stuck to my elbow. <laughs> like I said, God, my office is... And I'm pretty much always messy. So this needs to go over a little bit to cover up that last flower. I don't have deco. Hopefully that's straight. 
Yeah, somewhat. I need to fix it a little bit. Mm. I know I'm making you guys all like take a deep breath. It's okay. It'll be okay. I think I have a little bit of overhang. Oh well. Okay, so there's a gap right there. Ugh. I'll fix it later. I knew that was going to happen because I was trying to cover up this flower and then this flower was going to stick out. But like I said, I have this handy dandy gold border that I might stick on the sides. I haven't decided yet. Yeah, because I think it'll look pretty there too. And there. Yeah. That's going to come in handy. Okay. <laughs> you guys are like, all right, keep going. <laughs> I'm working on it. Okay, half boxes. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. That can't be right. Where's the other ones? Um, those are only six half boxes. I definitely need seven. Okay, changing up again, changing up again. Yeah, because that's how I used, I used that one. I was going to use two of these for the sidebar, but that's not going to happen. I think I'm going to end up doing this and putting little checklist flags on there. Yeah, that's what I'll end up doing. It'll be okay. It'll work out. Yeah. Okay, I just whispered and you probably can't even hear that. I said it would all work out. Okay, so if I want to do this down here, I either need two washies or at least one big one. So, and I can't use this one up against that one. That won't work. I don't like that one. That one can't go next to this one. It's just this one's so bright. Not bright. Red is not bright. Okay, what if I did these right there? And then did like the avocados up top or something. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. I'm gonna put this down. Oh, actually, is there meal planning stickers? Oh, there is. I can use those. See how that works out. Don't know yet. So this cat, these cactus are from the Planner Society from last month. I always keep those on my desk because it's like I want to use them. Or if like I have some pretty good friends that we swap washi, I'll send them samples because I know they don't get the box or whatever. Because sometimes, like, we really don't know what we each other's have in our stash. So it's, like, hard to buy for other planner girls anyway. Okay. So I'm going to put the half box down. And then kind of see where I'm at. With putting in, like, this meal planner header. See, the avocados aren't very wide. It looks wide, but it's actually like a sticker on there. She closed it with this little piece of white tape. That's cute. Okay, so I want the avocados to go up. I wonder if I have to cut it instead of tear it. Because it feels kind of plasticky. Okay, so I'm going to try this side first. I don't know how removable this is either. Yeah, it feels like a sticker. Be interesting. I've never used these before. Okay, so I don't want it to go up on that because then you can't see it. That's fun. Okay, let's see if it tears with this. Nope. Mm. Yeah, definitely not. Mostly just stretching it. So we're gonna get my teeny tiny scissors. Nip it. There. That's fun. A little dancing avocados. The middles almost look blue because the they're shiny. They have like a silver inside. It's fun. I haven't used this before. Okay, then this one. Try to kind of because you have to pull it to kind of get the bumps out. Not being on there. I had never seen this washi until she gave me some. Which basically it's not washi, it's like a sticker. 
Just to let you know. Oh yeah, my habit is to go for that thing. There. Okay. So that one's done. I actually don't like avocados. We've talked about this. I'm not talking about it again. <laughs> You're like, thank goodness. <laughs> Just gonna move on. Okay. So I don't think I'm gonna use the meal planning sticker. Or the fork and spoon and knife. I'd rather have the avocado washi. That's why. But I will have to use it on... Maybe I will. So I'll have to use it on the top three and cover that up. Mm-hmm. I'm really thinking that gold trim will be nice. Okay, so I'll get this one here. And we'll grab this one. The same size. Yep. Put this one in. There. And then we need to take a fork and a knife and put it on that. Right there. There. Just to cover up the top three things that it said. Okay, so I said I was going to put the gold washi down. Which I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. This little skinny gold washi. It came with my Fiesta kit. It's like foily, not glitter. It's like a foil tape. Okay, so I'm gonna go from up here. And it's gonna be kind of at an angle, but that's okay, because I just wanna cover up that, those flowers. See how this tears. I don't know if that tears real well. Yeah, it does. I've never used it. I haven't used a foil washi, I don't think. I keep hitting my scissors with my elbow. Sorry. <laughs> I whispered again, sorry. <laughs> it's hard to remember. Sometimes the mic doesn't pick up if I'm quiet. I know. And sometimes I get quiet when I'm thinking. It's a very difficult situation. No, it's not that bad. Okay, this one. Kind of fun, it's like crack washy. Like from the Pretty Planner kit. <laughs> like when I do that. <laughs> Oh, maybe I should do the top there because there is a little bit of a gap. You know I'm going to do it. I love washi. I know, there is an extra edge over here too, but I don't think I'm going to do that. I say that knowing full well I might, by the way. I don't want it to overhang because then I have to trim it. There. Right there. Sorry if you can't see all of this. Oh yeah, you can. Okay, good. Okay. So there's that border. And we'll do this one. Sorry, hit the camera. Stand arm thingy, my bobber. I don't even know what that's called. I think I actually have to film on the night of my birthday. So. <laughs> like, honey, we can't stay out too late. <laughs> I have to be home and film. <laughs> yeah, because it's a Saturday. And today is Saturday. My film on Saturdays. I mean, you guys see it on Sunday, but I film it before that. If that makes sense. Okay, so this is going to go here. And it fits, like, almost perfectly. That's crazy. I'm, like, super happy that I bought this tube. And I was hanging out with Krista. Oh, I'm going to meet another one of my planner friends. I'm going to meet... Plan as you wish. Did I tell you guys that? I don't know if I did or not. Next month. Next month. We are going to meet. Super excited. Should I go all the way across? Yeah. I can hear it. The cheers. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know what you guys are saying. No idea. When I do my live, plan with me, I will. I know. I keep talking about it because I'm excited, but I still haven't decided on the date or a time. <laughs> I just know it'll be in July, so it's not, obviously, because June's almost over. And then I probably won't do it again for a really long time, because I'll have school again. <laughs> if that makes sense to you guys. Okay, so I'm going to do it again. I'm going to put down my boxes first, and then I'll do that one. Although I feel like I did cover up June, a little, June and July a little bit there, but that's okay. 
All right, so I need my to buy header for this side. And then I'm gonna use this. I don't think I have a Monday through Sunday sticker either, and I usually do that in my sidebar. Nope, that's interesting. Okay. So maybe I should change this. Hmm. Okay, what if I do this? Usually I don't have a ton of on my grocery list, so I'm gonna use my top three. Take that off. I know, me and my sticker problems. Put the top three down as my mini grocery list. Cover the header with the to buy sticker. And then I need to use some washi tape. Um, reuse what's in the kit. Some chili peppers. Oh, took off two of those. There. Use that. And then I need a header that says, like, there we go. Do dinners. So I put down like what our list of options of dinners we can have this week are based on the groceries that we have. And then what we actually eat is what goes on the today box, this one. Even though it doesn't say today right now. Okay, so I'm gonna put this down. And then I'm gonna stack checklist because basically I'm gonna check it off once we have eaten it. Okay, where's my checklist? So I'm going to use this one, put that right there, which I think I'll end up with six instead of seven, but honestly we eat out at, at the least once a week, because <laughs> we usually have a pizza and movie night at least once a week now, at least during the summer. I'm not sure we'll be able to keep that up during the school year, but Here's to trying. So I'm going to cover up the flag end of the first one so it just looks like one long one. That's all I did. Okay, then I guess we'll use this chili pepper sticker because I already had it on my thumb. And we need a habit tracker. I think I'm going to go with red because all my other stuff has kind of been red. I'll put that down. And then we need some more of that chili stuff. I think two rows of that. Ooh. Two rows of that. That'll just look like a double sticker. There. And then we need the gold to come by. And where did I put it? Oh, it's right here. It's really hard to see when it's like that. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> like, where did I put it? <laughs> like, did I knock it off the desk? Because that happens a lot. Let me grab my paper so I can go like that with it. So I want it to go like this. And then kind of out. I need it to stick right there. And then I need it to move outward so we don't cover up anything, but that's not going to happen. Okay, so here's what I think I'm going to do. I'm going to stop it right there because I'm tearing a sticker. Ugh. I'm going to do some right there. I'm trying to get the end of it there. Okay, and then... I think it's actually too wide to go up the side. Based on like the stickers, I should have put it down. Yeah, I'll have to trim it, I think. Maybe not. No, I'm good. Doesn't cover anything up. Okay. All right. Just cause I want to cover up those flowers that don't match. Okay, let's snip this off. And I'm starting to think I should just cover up that box. 
Like just take the rest of the gold and cover the July, June, July thing. Because I don't really need it. I know what month it is. And it just kind of looks funny cut off. I'm just going to cover it up. I know what month it is. I don't need it to tell me. A little bit lower so it doesn't get too puffy either. I don't think I have any month stickers left. Oh, come on. There. Okay. Kind of started holding on me, getting wrinkles. Alright, that looks like that. Now we need the weekend banner off this sheet. And it's glittery, so I'm gonna put it down here. Looks good. And then we have hump day sticker for Wednesday. And then we have big cup of nope. Happy meal, coffee, work errands, TV. Don't need any of those right now. Um, I pretty much use all of this sheet except for the other washi. We have some quarter boxes on this one. I used all of that one. A little bit of checklist left. Habit tracker and quarter boxes. And then some quarter boxes on that one too. And then quarter boxes on this one. So not too bad actually. Pretty good. Okay, so some stuff we can go ahead and plan. I'm gonna line it up so you guys can see everything. Okay, so payday. I get paid for my actual job on my birthday, but I'm gonna go with a little sticker. But actually, I get paid on the last day at business day of the month, so it'll be over here. So I get paid there. This is from Sticker Monster Co. as well. And then for Coffee Monday, I'm going to use this one. Um, pretty planner. It's a little hedgy coffee. I'm going to go with this little girl with the pink cup. Kind of cute. And then um, feed the dog. I have to make sure I feed the dog every day. These are from Cupcakes and Stickies. So I put dog stickers down every day because so I have to rinse out her water bowl and feed her and play with her a little bit so that she gets some time because she's a backyard dog, if that makes any sense at all. Okay, and then feed the cat. I have these little cat bowls from Penelope Dutch and Jackie sent me these. And thanks for ordering, Jackie. I think you ordered twice this week. <laughs> Oh, you're so adorable. It was different stuff, unless I had two Jackies, but I didn't think I did, so. I don't know. I'm just going across so I use all the colors, because it doesn't really matter to me if my bowls of cat food match. There you go. Okay, and then we have planning time. So this one is from Plan of Pizzazz. This is Zazzy, so I'm gonna use her, because I plan this planner on Saturdays, so we'll see if that happens on my birthday. <laughs> my plan with me may be late on Sunday. Just calling it out right there because I don't know what's happening. Um, and then the habit tracker over here is for my son, brush his teeth. I'm gonna use a little bit bigger monster. Brushing his teeth. This is from Sticker Monster Go. My character sticker is this little fox. I'm gonna do a little sleepy fox down there. This is from Pretty Alice. She's not an Etsy shop, she just, likes doing stickers. So this one is from Sticker Monster Co. And this one actually says trash day. So I'm gonna start using this one for Wednesday. Um, and then my like little characters taking out the trash will be like every other time. But I think I'm gonna go with this orange one. But I thought these are pretty cool because it actually says trash day. Cause I have stickers for like putting trash out in the bin, but not like in my house. Okay. So I found these, so my before the pen this is my last one. So before the pen post happens on Mondays, spread pick happens on Sundays, and then my midweek pick happens on Wednesdays. So, and then I have my little rosy camera to go with it. Rosy Fox Pictures, that's what it says, from Pretty Planner. This is from Planner Love SP. And then I have countdown stickers for my birthday. I thought those would be fun. Okay, so one day until my birthday would be the 
29th. I'm going to put it on the header a little bit because I don't really have a header. These are from Mochi Kichi, if you didn't know. They're a fairly new Etsy shop, and they're based out of Canada. And I know I have some of you that are Canadian, and you're always looking for other Canadian shops. So I like to feature some as well. Okay, and then I'm going to put happy birthday, I guess, on my birthday. We're ending the countdown. So cute. Love it. Okay, weather. Let's talk about the weather. Okay, so Monday is mostly cloudy. I'm going to use these cloudy stickers from Cupcakes and Stickies. So that's Monday. Used up that sheet. And then Tuesday is also partly cloudy. I have another one. And then Wednesday is partly cloudy. This is our main weather. And then Thursday is sunny. I ruined like all five of those. I got them wet. It happens. All right, and then Friday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday are all sunny. So the rest of the week is sunny. And these are from Stickerific. I don't PR for them, but I like their stickers. They're cute. Okay, that's it for those. Okay. So I think that's the way it's going to look this week. I was checking if there was any other functionals I thought I might use, but I don't think I will. So let's go ahead and put the clips on. You can see that. That was the AC turning on. Sorry. It's hot in here. Actually, it wasn't too bad today, but perfect weather for my husband's birthday. I will not be that lucky. When it says sunny, it's going to be like 95. On my birthday, it's going to be 95. It's actually going to be 89. It's going to be like in the 90s all week. <laughs> For me, anyway. So there's my clips. So I hope you guys like this spread. Give this video a like and please subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!